Hello everyone. In this video, we'll be discussing the different tips to score good in biology. ICSC grade tenth. Please do keep watching. Now, first is how to do a quick revision. Now, the first would be make points of the topics which you have learned. Now. mostly we have everything in the form of paragraphs in our books you need to make points of those topics now how will it help you it's going to help you in one marker one mark questions it's going to help you in fill ups it's going to help you in uh, difference differentiate that means all together it's going to help you in section number 1 okay so main thing which you need to keep in mind is while making points that you consider the uh, one liners then uh, suppose you have location of the following uh, function of the following so you just make points of those all the paragraphs should be jotted down in points that means from one page you'll make approximately 20 points then page wise you move okay so that will help you a lot while your exams are there you have like i think it's on 20th of march so you have ample of time abhi to uh, divide your time among your subjects and then start revising then is highlight the important points highlighting highlighting very very important when you highlight an important point you make sure that the examiner reads it like for example suppose we have write notes on following okay for for example for notes specially we need to highlight suppose i have written a paragraph i want the examiner to, to read these specific lines and words underline those highlight those that is going to help you out then learn the definitions word to word now when i say definitions word to word i mean the definition should be properly you know correct and it should be uh, learned exactly the same you are not supposed to give any definitions of your own definitions always carry one mark okay so most probably definitions there is a question of definitions define the following they give at least five definition most common it's five definitions so uh, if if it's a five marker one one mark each for five definitions so please learn the definitions properly i will suggest to write all the definitions chapter wise separately and then learn you write um, take a notebook take a separate notebook on that give the heading definition chapter number 1 uh, it's um, uh, genetics cell division uh, uh, write the name of the chapter write all the definitions Uh, in cell division mostly i think five or six definitions will be there hmm so just jot, jot down those come to the next chapter uh, genetics laws write down then when you sit for an exam or you can say when you are revising for an exam this type of a preparation is going to help you a lot okay then practice your diagrams very important uh, sorry experiments of plant physiology to be practiced and it's a sure shot question to come it's a question which is going to be there that means out of plant physiology we have three chapters of plant physiology we have many experiments in those out of those three chapters one for sure in section a it comes like mostly it's there like uh, 90% and in section b also in section b also we have almost one question from the experiment so please don't leave this question it's a very important question write all the experiments all together maybe there are not even 10 experiments just write or you can say Mm, uh, uh, write them somewhere uh, aim of experiments and then revise them just see the diagrams as well it will make it easy for you so it's a short sure, short sure question please do it next is practice all the crosses crosses a sure shot question and a mono di hybrid plus a cross for sex determination very important crosses this time as already told in my previous videos di hybrid cross has maximum chances to come because last time it was a mono hybrid cross usle last time it was a di hybrid cross so this time most probably di hybrid cross is going to be there practice the crosses thoroughly and then write and practice actually next is make a table for endocrine glands now when i say a table i mean a table make a table for endocrine glands that means your table should be the name of the gland then it comes the secretion 
then would be the fun function and then it would be the under and over secretion or hypo and hyper condition you can uh, you can write hypo condition what happens hyper condition what happens if this table is going to help you a lot in many papers this table directly is there in the paper they just uh, give you blanks that means they'll be making this table here this table is going to be sorry this table is going to be here and then they will just uh, give you some glands they'll give blanks and all and hence you need to answer so that's an important question next is solve five to six sample papers now it can be more than that but as of now it can be five to six that's i think it's sufficient if you have practiced a lot if you have revised a lot five to six sample papers will give you a lot of questions okay you'll get a lot of questions and you will see that the questions are repeating so that will help you also okay uh, uh, finding the answers writing the answers and memorizing them also previous year board questions if you if you can find them please do those also it helps a lot they are very important and plus here i have specially mentioned diagrams of the stages of cell division are very important okay a question one question for sure from cell division is going to come and they ask you to draw the or draw the stage also so you practice all the stages thoroughly practice bar bar likho and practice them it's a very important question next is concentrate well on functions now i've i've marked them uh, you need to learn the functions of the parts the structures the distinguish between or you can say the differences okay these are the questions which separately come like for example they'll give you a five marker write the functions of following they'll give you a five marker write the location of the following they'll give you a five marker that differentiate between the following so these are certain questions which you you need to practice then practice answering the last 10 icsc papers okay last 10 icsc board question papers वैसे तो i in my previous videos we have discussed about those i have already given you uh, the uh, different uh, questions which are important for this year and are supposed to come i have jotted down all the questions from last 10 years only but still if you find them somewhere please do that it will help you a lot next is some things to keep in mind during exams they are in a habit to over attempt now i'll suggest no over attempting i'll suggest do not over attempt but still if you want to please do the questions which are sure short like for example you know okay 100 percent i know the answer do those questions first matlab the first five questions should be your the first five questions should be your uh, questions which you know 101 percent and the next two should be the one which you are going to now um, which you think okay fine uh, i can answer next is avoid spelling errors spelling errors should not be there because uh, it's especially it's in one marker questions why because in spelling errors if it's a one marker question your spelling is wrong obviously you lose marks so please don't don't do that learn the spellings properly revise your answers after completion of the paper rectify your mistakes in spellings or missed out terms and phrases please do that because once you revise the answer sheet you get to you get a lot of things where you can rectify your mistakes please do it so that your paper is flawless now best of luck I know these tips are going to help you a lot. Please do follow them, write them somewhere, follow them, start revising with your, you know, give, I'll suggest uh, if you give like three days to biology in three days, your syllabus will be over. Notes will be made. Yes, you have to give your day and night in it. But yes, it is going to help. Thank you. Thanks a lot. Keep liking, sharing, subscribing.